North Korea claims it successfully tested a hydrogen bomb. A television anchor read a statement on state TV that said North Korea had tested a miniaturized hydrogen bomb after seismic activity was reported. The U.N. Security Council has tentatively, tentatively set an emergency meeting after North Korea's claim. The White House says it cannot confirm the test but says the U.S. would condemn any violations of United Nations Security Council resolutions. A friend of San Bernardino gunman Saeed Farouk is expected to be arraigned today. Charges against Enrique Marquez include providing material support to terrorists, making false statements, and marriage fraud. If convicted, Marquez could be sentenced to up to 50 years in prison. Michigan Governor Rick Snyder has declared a state of emergency in Flint over problems with lead in the city's drinking water. The city temporarily switched from Detroit's water system to the Flint River water in a cost-cutting move in 2014. Residents complained about the water's taste and children were found to have elevated levels of lead. About 30 area employers are expected to take part in a Springfield job fair today. It's from noon to 3 at the former 31 Gifts on Titus Road. Today's event is hosted by Ohio Means Jobs and the Chamber of Greater Springfield.